Hey gang, uh, this is Friday Biology. This is a game that I've been playing for a while. Uh, I originally started playing on just when it was multiplayer only, uh, P vs P, uh, squad kind of stuff. Uh, you ran around in the dark. You ran through uh, swamp, prairie land, which then became snow, which then became basic darkness with moonbeams and things, which then became a fire fire. Uh, a forest fire which just kind of swept over the area which then became a landscape which just dramatically changed it, this game has had a few different alterations and differences and it's actually had, we'll, we'll kind of show you a thing nope it's not gonna work uh, how do we show you yeah they, my points are like <laughs> not existent yet uh, was trying to get this and then just kind of gave up because it just it branched, it became big. We'll go play on Higo. Uh, you, you have these areas, right? Two opposing compounds. Turn the volume down a little bit, right? Two opposing compounds on each side. Environment modes include day, overcast and foggy, raining, dawn, night, pitch black, thunder, and war zone, right? Very beginning, you had a massive map, which was very simple to traverse. You had little buildings around all the way through, and it would just rotate between. Uh, we have arch, we have elevation. This is a cool map. Uh, everything changes. Uh, floors. Should we see if we can show you this? This is the map, right? Uh, right back to free count. Now let's just show you. It's a bit slow, actually. There we go. This is awesome, isn't it? Right? Okay, we have our little helmet. Uh, let's get rid of our helmet for a moment. Okay, we have our gun. We can change our gun by pressing 2. It has dynamic zooming. I would have thought there'd be something down there, but I will. Okay, uh, never press F. F is your flashlight, F will get you killed. Instead, use your lasers only when you need it. Oh, come on, I want the environment to change, man. Is there a button? We're just pressing around a button. U brings up the Interstellar Marines kind of version. This is version 0 0.515. Uh, oh, we just killed ourselves. Awesome, K is kill, I think. There we go, this is what I want, okay. How cool is that? Right, you have new areas opening up here. Right, oh man. Normally during a firefight, right, you'll be in here having a co-op kind of fighting. This this little corner here opens up, that little doesn't. So you have a little box area, but then like, you run in here, and then you run over here, and this might be rising, so you jump onto here, and that rises up above. It's... Look, this goes nowhere anymore. Before it used to go there. So that original staircase, right? I like this up. It's better. Let's put a flashlight on because flashlight is cool. Here we go. Sit. Bit staircase goes down. Still nothing. Alright. Yep, yeah, still nothing. I wish there was a manual button to make everything go ham. I don't care. Toggle helps. Okay, let's put on science. Science should be S, but no, we'll put it up because... Oh, that is sweet! That is cool. Okay, admittedly this isn't that great. <laughs> Wait, what other things can we do? Uh, yeah, I know about these. <sighs> Next, change team. Yeah, I... Is there an alternative firing button? That would be cool. Oh, yeah, don't run this one. Two. Oh! I want to go on this one. How cool is that? That is cool, right? 
you can imagine, right? You're playing in the dark because all the all these lights can turn off. Actually, no, we can't destroy this. Damn, that'd be cool. Uh, some of these lights you can destroy. Well, at least when I was playing this map before, you could destroy lights and make literally a pitch black kind of area. Um, you then have these coming on, which is strobe effect, which probably is good for uh, guys who are seizures, ep uh, epidemic snow. Oh, I'll think of the name later. Damn it. Can't jump. Well, not that high anyway. Oh, yeah. Give us text. We're going to the new six. So, um, no, let's have a look at another map. There's got to be another map. Uh, what's another? Uh, this is the co op kind of one. Um, it is rather cool. Uh, yeah, we'll show you this. Uh, that is cool, right? The thing is that uh, in the co op, you have these doors. You can open them, you can go up. There's a little cafeteria. Actually, we'll show you a co op. Uh, we'll come back to that. Uh, fun map. Mm, I didn't really play much on this one. Uh, more because I just kind of played on whatever maps were full and we jump in. Okay, let's take this off. Because I don't like moisture effect. Oh. Damn it! I wanted to go up. Uh, there may be nasty bacterial stuff. Rain. Now, this is all in a dome. Uh, you'll notice that this is a taser weapon. Uh, directly above the flashlight key. You know how to run through here and just kind of... Shooting. Let's put on the sars. That, that is awesome, isn't it? Hopefully we get to see a thunderstorm. Thunderstorms are actually kind of cool. Uh, we want to try and get to higher ground, maybe? Let's just see if we can go in here. That would be cool. There we go. Does this go anywhere? You can hide. <laughs> okay, camping, but uh, not great camping because... Okay. Yeah, we're crouched. Nope. Uh, the more you hold the space bar, the greater your release, which means you jump higher. So I'm just kind of walking you. Oh, that is sweet. This is going to get shot at, but uh, yeah, that's probably not a good thing. Though it's good we can jump, rather than just glitching either side. Um, go up top. Oh, we can probably climb a tree. Sorry, I kind of have a thing for seeing how far I can get with a game like this. Damn it! Okay, that's the kind of glitchy it's. Oh, are we getting a new area? I know that... Ah, oh, no, this is day night, so... Okay, so uh, we're getting our fog coming in. Oh yay, someone says. South thunderstorm. That'd be cool. Uh, okay. Yeah, this is... This is, I think, over here. I know this big fog effect. Now my computer, you have to understand, is really, really crappy, right? So to have this, right, with no lag, with little ambient fog effects and little kind of crickets and things and like, it, it's not looped, it's just kind of a track. Well, I can't really tell whether it's looped actually, which is probably a good thing. 
it's probably a multiple loop thing. You get the little thunder crashes, um, and you get the lightning, and then you get the thunder crashes. That's good. I, I don't like games where they put them at the same time. It's a far off thunder effect happening somewhere else, right? Nice. <sighs> Bloody friends. Yeah, my TV has been turning on randomly. Um, I think it's a timer or something. I don't know. Yeah, anyway, uh, let's try another place because I've now found a silence. So it's kind of cool. Um, get killed by robots. This is pretty much like the co-op. It is the co-op. Awesome. Now, uh, robots are not much. Shit! Damn it. Robots are scary. That was bad. I know you're there, but I can hear you. That was probably cheating, but uh, we'll count it. Yeah, I know. You can't get up here because you, you know, AI to jump. Damn it, that was a... Ah! Damn it, he was waiting for me. Ah, far out. But, you can imagine, right? Imagine this, but playing with your mates, or just random people who you have no clue who they are. Uh, let's see if we've got anyone. Normally there's at least, yeah, there's normally a couple of European dudes. Or... Canadians or something. Uh, come on. No, we'll go. We'll hop in. Uh, let's do. Man, our ping is pretty bad. Let's do this one. It's decent enough ping. Now, I haven't played Escape A or Nucleus, so this is uh, going to be fun. We have a little bit. We'll Okay, press F to win, remember? <laughs> I, I, man, that is sweet. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Blinking lights. Oh, far out. So, uh, everything is working. So let's just go F to win. Um, <laughs> I don't want to die. Um, oh, I can hear him. You guys probably can hear them as well. Okay, red light means you can't open it yet. Ah, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Uh, what's our melee attack? Ah, oh, jeez. I can't remember our melee attack. F to win. Sweet. Access to most of the training areas is restricted. Locate key cards and access terminals to open more areas. Oh, I don't want to. <laughs> ah. Let's turn off that. The CTRs may be slow, but they hit hard. Yeah, I know. I don't think I want to go that way. rather die in 
P versus P. This, this gets creepy. Are you in here? I, I don't want to get off my box. Okay. There's set ammo, which is good. I can hear you. I know you're down there. Uh, let's get out of here. Don't press it twice. I'm just going to worry about alien spawns and... Ha! <laughs> I don't want to die. Ah, Jesus. I thought there was a little open bit. That would be horrible. You, you drop down and you get attacked from behind. Note to developers. Add that in. That would be cool. Uh, I saw you, you mother. Come on, buddy. Okay, all the doors are closed. I should have probably close the ones upstairs as well. Boxes of safety are not actually safety. There we go. Boxes of safety. Nope. Uh, we're uh, glitching a little bit. That's bad. <sighs> I don't want to die. Don't let me die. We'll probably need this key card. I... Can they open doors yet? It's red. They probably need this key card. <laughs> Which means guess who's going out there to play friends? Hello. So I've got probably a couple out there. Would be nice if we could put something on the glass to... Jesus, okay. Uh, we'll open this. Run, 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 run! <laughs> ah! Damn it. Ha! Ah. No, no, come back! And I've just let them into my... Uh, God damn it! That was uh, me panicking, guys. Don't worry. And uh, everything is normal, thank you. <laughs> uh, crap. Come on, Mr. Robot. There's two more of you left out there. One.
Hehehehe <laughs> I don't want to die Ah crap one got behind me Damn it No I don't want to restart That was bad Ha ah. Alright so um Yeah this is This is uh Pretty much <laughs> Everything. Uh, elimination. Common century robots have just got. This hasn't been here before. Ah, okay, so we have to escape the thing while being outnumbered. Okay. Survive the horde. Survive the horde. Campaign missions. Uh, this is what I was thinking that it was. Okay. So it was N Nucleus. Rather than what's this one? This one's nucleus as well, isn't it? Utrigen. Okay, Utrigen. Uh, this is pain. Well, this isn't pain. This is I think Friday night. Uh, Friday nights at Freddy's or Five Nights at Freddy's, right? Fridays, because that's when you play it, right? Wrong. Um, you should never play Five Nights at Freddy's. It's bad. It, well, it's jump scares. Yay happiness uh, this is scary shit uh, let's play a bit because I think we've only got a couple of minutes left we've only got uh, I don't know, eight minutes eight or so yeah uh, this is scary this is tactical this is strategy if you're playing the co-op ones you have to work together here we are okay so you know, the swamp crash down behind his these chairs, right? Uh, instead of this stuff, uh, you spawn in with four batteries. Yeah, uh, you can have an overseer, which is cool, uh, but that's to be la added later. Okay, uh, I like that. Sound. That is that is that is cool. Okay. We open onto a space station, right? F to win because it is dark and there is no power. And what we want to see located. is these guys. Uh, they are placeholders, I think, for zombie infected colonist people. You want this? So normally there's some robots. Hoping that screws you through your pathfinding. Okay, we have some lights. Let's close that door. Ah, jeez. Okay. Uh, One online. 
Yay. Proceed to the next power core location. I'm really starting to lose my patience with this woman. I know Safe the uh, people complaining, um, standard usual kind of space bullcrap kind of stuff. Come on, nasty robots. Ah. Ah, shit, okay. We have to go upstairs. God damn it! I knew you were there. Same system enabled. <sighs> There's shouldn't have done that. Jump. I know you don't like the light. So this is pretty much what it's like. Now there's no power drainage thingy like Freddy's, okay? So don't worry. It's just they, they don't like the light. I don't think I can shoot through that. And I don't think I can jump onto that. Oh yeah. Smooth. Got you, you son of a bitch. And he was unnamed. Don't worry. I can name him later. I want to get this thing. And I also want to turn lights on. I can see you. And you're scared of my light. And you're passing... Sucks at the moment. I think that was it. Which is probably a bad thing to say. Because that normally means there's going to be another one. Always close the doors in this game, guys. Yay! So now we have light. Yep. But guess what? That's open doors. So if you're with the partner, you make sure when well, the first guy opens the door, make sure the second guy closes it. Oh, we're just doing a stealthy, not so stealthy, because I know that we will need to make sure. Damn it. Oh, let's just forego giant killer robot pupils. Well, listen to this guy. Came around asking about the missing supplies from storage. Had to tell them about Dr. McGillan's last breakthrough and about the ramifications of the results. He became rather interested in my own side experiments, asking me to continue and not to worry about Stark's investigation. Apparently, his contacts in the ITO defense departments are interested in this line of research, which means that funding is no longer an issue, even if new. So I thought there was an event in here, which is why I came in here, but this is actually a bathroom. And I like vents because it's close and they can only come in one way. I'll leave that open. I know they don't like lights. That was pure flukage, guys. Maintenance required infiltration system. 
but were the lights for here? Don't let me die alone. Actually, what it needs is like a little radio or something. <laughs> Combat radio. Beatles soundtrack or something. I saw you and I heard you fall. God damn it. Yeah. It's that chopped off his leg, okay. No corner. I should have checked this corner first. Do 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 What does this button do? Oh, that's cool. I uh, know this is bad. This. Oh, you could have had jumpers and stuff. I don't know if I want to be in a dark room. Let's go up some stairs. Stairs never hurt anybody. There is somebody there. I don't know what that is. Go green. That was probably not a great thing to do, but uh, I don't know what was up with that guy. Uh, in case you guys haven't realized, we're trying to get to that. What's this? Ah, fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> Where is the horde? Ah, this is uh, powered off. Oh, okay, we need to crouch. Don't worry. I thought they blew up, but uh, red barrels don't in this game. Okay. So, in this uh, environment, there are living areas, and there are as you. Uh, the more we kill, the better, because uh, later on they kind of hunt. But that one was kind of hunting, but not really. Any open doors? Huzzah! We have lights. So... <laughs> we still need to go to A's. Uh, problem with this game, like my biggest problem is that these giant robots are really simple to deal with early on. So theoretically you could spend half an hour to an hour just Roaming around hunting and not actually going and setting up lights stuff like it would be kind of cool like just roaming around in the dark with uh, your uh, laser swords flashing around yeah but uh, with lights it makes it cooler like this is or was a research station ish uh, we find out later on it's a little bit more than that but <laughs> yeah it, it had giant robots yay. How do you guys get up? You guys have to come up here, don't you? Damn it. Damn it. I can hear you. Damn it! Okay, so you saw that, okay? This is the crazy bit. This is the scary bit, right? They adapt, they change, the AI at the very beginning is sluggish, it can't see you, there is no actual interaction. Right, these lights, like, you can kill them off, right? I don't know. Yeah, you can kill those. Awesome. Okay, these, all the lights, can we kill these? Okay, they don't like lights, so they go into the dark areas. And this one just run, and he's seeking cover. That's what he's doing. Oh, 
Wrong gun. Shit! No, 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 no! Shit! Ah! <laughs> Failed. Oh, uh, we're starting. Awesome. This game is awesome. You should grab it. Uh, Verdict-wise, though, if you don't like hardcore shooters, you will probably hate this. Uh, d just let you know. If you've got a, if you've got a clan, actually. So, I don't know, a, a group who you play regularly on World War Z or something, yeah? Energy reroute successful. Let's just mute you from it. If you have a game where you and a mate play regularly, you know how each other think, you know exactly what you should be doing and everything, right? This game will be awesome. Why is it exactly? Problem is, it's a hardcore shooter and you will dislike this immensely uh, you do have a heap of objectives right like realistic difficulty you're not going to be able to survive this hard difficulty right you could survive with a really good team who you know what they're thinking as they're doing it uh, when you die as one guy right you respawn back in the uh, the metal melagonon uh, the big ship thingy, right, that you spawned in the very beginning. And then you have to track through it all on your own, right? With a group, you can survive an onslaught with three other guys, right? You lose two of them, that one guy hides, everyone comes up to a group, you could do it. Uh, realistic, you need a clan, you need some group that you can do all this stuff, right? The problem is that you then have these achievements. Collect all audio logs. This is scrounging for stuff it is painful it is awesome you find a few you hate the rest it's just kind of listening to people complain is fun it gives you a little bit more inside bit backstory rather than just going around killing robots uh, that being said to get this sharp picture on your profile like on steam would be fucking awesome uh just getting like a piranha and a snake maybe not but that arachnid looks awesome uh, it is in colour, it is very cool. Anyway, uh, I should probably not do ratings, but th this is a, a 10 out of 10 game. Uh, it is, from where it's come originally to where it is now in a year, right, is awesome. It is still updating, they're still doing stuff, they're active in the community. They do, like, a, a dev plus community kind of thing every now and then like a once a month kind of thing where you go onto a team speak server with the dev with everyone else and if you have a problem issue suggestion you talk to them about and they add it in uh i suggested a, a mirror at the end of a walkway or a hallway in one of the living areas you're going to open a door and there'll be a looming shadow in front of you it's a mirror don't worry but the problem is that laser and the flashlight and the actual build up to that point you don't expect it to be there once you see it and that you get the first jump scare it is like it's all over you know it's there uh sometimes however there is a giant robot there uh which is like a pain in the ass so uh have a look for it this is a very cool game uh it probably will be on sale for christmas grab it then grab it now grab it whenever but just grab it have a look at it it's pretty good if you don't like it now have a look at it in a year or so like seriously uh you'll have i think a lot more uh interaction with this game as a gamer in your life than I mean, something something stupid uh like bloody cod or something where yes you get points and you've got ratings like you can have ratings here right but uh you you really want to have a game that you're going to enjoy this is a game that you're going to live with yeah yeah later